Hello guys, welcome back. It almost seems like the theme at this point, but today we're going to be showing you a defect prismatic shard. I don't know where I got this idea where I could take prismatic shards in Ascension 20 and get away with it, but I've been getting away with it. And in this one we have Wraithform, Apparitions, and a whole bunch of other goodies you're going to have to find out. But before I let you guys go, I want you guys to write in the comments what kind of runs you guys want to see. Like right now we're going to get through this backlog, but after I'm done, we can do some specialized YouTube content. So let me know what kind of runs you guys want to see. And now for the defects. The coveted defect. Oh my god, is it going to be 250 gold all across the board? You get the gold, you get the gold, you get the gold. And with gold, we persevere. Take a look at this path we have here. We have um, got this after the shop. Okay, we also have this eh, not that great and we have that not that great not that great how many elites that run had an um, infinite amount of elites just about give or take infinite plus or minus infinity now is it just 250 gold okay wait what if it's just 100 gold and I go for a different path like for instance um by the way, guys, check now if the VODs are publishing, if you guys do not mind. I'm going to take a quick little water break. And you guys decide if you guys want to take 100 gold or 250 gold. And the theme of today has been the gold run uh, runs. Un día de oro. So, por eso yo quiero, you know, yo quiero elegir más oro. Pero yo soy un hombre muy... Averioso, no? Como se dice, avaroso, avariososo, no sé. Let's do it. It's a shame. How do I say greedy in Spanish? Let's find out. Avericioso. Ah, I was correct. Glotón. Cod codicioso. Goloso. Hmm, okay. Good to know, good to know. I have 15 damage. He has 16 life. Satch. Map does not compute. Alright, guys. What's the shop gonna be? Alright. Floor 1 Chaos or Floor 1 Rebound? Personally, Chaos could be interesting. Chaos could be interesting. But rebound is damage, and it's damage that I can rely on. And we have enough gold for a rare relic. And the relic is. Gremlin Horn. Gremlin Horn is very good. Doesn't help the Gremlin knob. It doesn't help the log of Vulin, but it helps everything in between those things, so I can get to those things a little bit healthier, right? Besides, we have Fire Pot. And Fire Pot's very good. Two things. We can take Bullseye to have our damage. We can take Focus Pot for the Elite, or we can take Removal on this freaking shame. Let's go. How you doing, Keeks? What's crack a lacking, brother? How's chat doing in general, guys? How's chat doing? I know it's been a laggy day. I'm doing my best. How's everybody feeling? What time is it over there in that part of the world? Are you guys eating dinner? Are you guys getting ready for bed? Are you walking your dog? Are you at work right now? Uh, early consume, yes or no? Early consume. There was a capacitor in the shop. Wish I, if I knew that the capacitor was, I would have taken this consume. If I knew the capacitor consume would have been a thing.
What's the consensus on early consume? All right, now this is the real question, guys. Wait, scratch everything. I need valuable input, guys. Valuable input only. Wrong answers only, okay? We have two paths here. Both of these paths have two elites, right? What's more worthwhile? Going for two hallway fights or two events? Now, hallway fights are easier because we have the Gremlin Horn. And that gives you cards. Plus, it can give you potions. Cards and potions, right? And gold, of course. Or... We go to the events, and okay. Well, first off, we gotta decide what we want to consume. We'll decide now. Okay, if, if I'm committed to this left side of the map, which I think I am, because I want two elites and I want to use fire pot, I think I want to go for more hallway fights. But these are gonna be hard pull, hard pull. No, this is easy pull, hard pull. I've been working on Friday night. Let's go. I just realized it's Friday night. We're going to start tacking into the nice uh, nighttime evening mode. Cool. Adventure fun. Why are events fun? What if, it, what if the event is a four shop, Phil, Phil Grix? If the event is a four shop, how do we rectify the situation, Phil Grix? You say events are fun. I believe you like a little kid. I get a four shop. What do we do in that situation? What's our resolution? Because I want to, I'm going to feel some type of way. I'm going to, I'm going to take it out on you. I paid for this Gremlin Horn, by the way, Euler. I paid big money for this. You're saying consume? Isn't one use of consume better than three sides to no consume? Yes, one use of consume is like that, but it's also two cost. It costs two. But I'm, I'm going to take the fights. But the thing is, consume could be nice, yes. If you get, like opens up loop, it opens up... Uh, the shred of a rebound. Stream beam, barrage. All right. Rebound to me, beam. <laughs> Rebound to me, beam, baby. Look at that. Lito. Ball lightning. Yum, 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 yum. Rebound, sweeping, ball. What do you guys want? What about a zap? Because zap goes with the rebound. Yes, sir. Or even dual cast, I guess. Rebound into rebound. Oh my goodness. This person is rude. I can't believe I get to keep my fire pot, but then what was the point of going for this elite and not using any potion? Core search. <laughs> Oh, oh, Stephen Beam is good for the triple century, but man, that is a relic for the price of a Stephen Beam, which isn't that valuable. I mean, it's nice, but not like that valuable.
Put him on the fan. All right. Wow, Vajra. But now the thing is, the problem is if I triple sentry, right? What? The internet seems to be good now. I, I wrote you on Discord. Do you guys want to upgrade dual cast? All right, what do you got here? All right, depending on what dual cast hits here, with the fire pot, I could play dual cast again this turn. So if I rebound dual cast, depending on what the dual cast hits, Uh, but I gotta do this first so I can see what to rebound. All right, I can block for four, but do big ass damage. You guys prefer that? Or you want to do ball any block block? Rebound into rebound. Damn. Damn, my deck is doing work. Bro, what? How is my internet dropped? I'm here. I'm still here, guys. Uh, is it Barrage? With the Vajra. I'm here. Nope. Nope. Victor with a Twitch Prime. Welcome back, buddy. Appreciate you. Thank you. Yeah, the pizza was really good. Yeah, I also want some internet frames. Where the hell is the internet? Oh my god. Barrage with the Vajra. I don't have enough block though. Alright, event time. Damn, this fight was nice and easy. My deck is great. I'm doing all the damage. This is like probably... I'm just playing really well today. I'm just on another level today. Go for the eyes of Reinforced Body. Reinforced Body is great block. Go for the eyes. It's a nice weaken though. Weaken's pretty fucking good. Especially if you can rebound it. But that's a lot of block. Reinforced Body. I'm just, I can't miss today. Today has just been a, just winning all across the board. Barrage is back. Barrage is back with the vengeance. Hologram is not back because Hologram has dual cast and zap. 
right? Hologram has super ca dual cast and zap. Barrage does some decent damage though. I like that damage. We could upgrade a card. Oh my, we could upgrade the barrage and we could even upgrade our um reinforced body. Upgrade that barrage. What else do you want to upgrade? We could even upgrade like a leap if we wanted, a reinforced body if we wanted, ball of lightning if we wanted. Now look at this. Now we have some stuff for Act 2 and for... Ooh. Not bad. Not bad at all. And I can do a cast now. Push that damage. Because we can make lightning no problem. With things like... Rebound ball lightning. Look at that. Things like rebound ball lightning. Rebound ball lightning again. It's just non-stop rebound ball lightning. I might as well reach and pot this fight, right? Because do I need it for the next act? All right, my question is, do you think I need re uh, re reach and pot for this fight? I don't think so. What's my potion chance, though? What's my potion chance? So, I was asking, do we want region putt to use it? Like, do you guys think our damage is quick enough in this fight? We have, by the way, I don't know if you guys, what you guys missed, but I picked up a barrage. I upgraded the barrage from the event right before the thing, so we got, we had a barrage. We upgraded, let me show you the map. This was an event to upgrade or transform. I upgraded the barrage. I also upgraded a reinforced body. So now we have block for act two with reinforced body and leap. We have a core surge for bias cog waiting room. We have good damage with rebound, rebound, rebound stuff with the b barrage. Plus, and the Vajra with the Zap, the dual cast. This deck is just smooth sailing. You just got the going live message? I'm four hours of the stream. Crazy. Even your stream elements is telling me I'm not live. This is, this is a nightmare. Let's get the horsers out of the out of the way. One minute into the stream. Oh, we got rebound on the barrage. No, I meant to do zap first. Damn it! Oh wait, I meant to do zap first though. Lethal! Look at that fight! Look at the fight! Look at the run! I killed him before the second attack. And we got a potion back. Love it! Alright, you guys want a reboot, a rainbow, or a thunder strike? Well, technically, I'm going live for you guys. Well, we should be good now. We should be good. I mean, honestly, I don't know. I'm not an internet whisperer. <clears throat> Whenever I think the internet is good, it doesn't, whatever. I, let's try to focus on the content, the PowerPoint, PowerPoint slide here. Let's try to make every slide enjoyable here. <clears throat> um. Okay. Rainbow's interesting. Got Dark Orb, I like Dark Orbs. It makes Barrage pop off immediately. Plus, we have dual cast to manipulate stuff. Reboot school card draw. Thunderstrike. Thunderstrike has Vajra, and we have Ball Lightning Zap. Thunderstrike immediately has like three procs on it. So this can be three for three. Alright, so this could be 20. No, 24 damage for three. Da for three. Okay, this is 24 damage basically for one. We're good. Okay, let's do Rainbow. Let's go. 
We're good. Pyramid, Kursky, Dripper. Um, Pyramid's pretty broken. I would like energy, though. So let's decide. Pyramid's usually pretty broken. But energy's also quite nice. If I take the pyramid, this core surge is going to be beautiful. Reinforced body is going to be beautiful. Aggregate turbo is going to be nice. Damn. All right. I need a vote in the chat. If you want pyramid, let me know. Because otherwise I'm taking the drip drip. If you want pyramid, let me know. Pyramid versus drip. I need to know. A mid versus drip gang. I want chat's input on this. This is the deck. These are the relics. They both probably win. They both probably win. <laughs> Pyramid goes crazy. Okay, but Drip Drip goes crazy too. Gotta go for the Drip Drip. The Pyramid Core Church speaks for like... I can hold on to the... We do get energy with Gremlin Heart a little bit too. Pyramid does go crazy, huh? Damn, we also can make like make reinforce body really good. Let's go pyramid boys. The drip is good, don't get me wrong. Alright, do you wanna go for all the elites? Let's go for some events. Where's my melter? Well, that's unfortunate because this barrage is super sad. The barrage is super sad. How do we make barrage less sad? Cause I can't just take it no more This is part where I break free How much damage does a man have? A man has a lot of damage He's got 18 plus 21 39 39 plus 3 42, 42 plus 8, 50. 50 is lethal. Potion of capacity. Ooh, we gotta compile this cold snap. Ooh. Let's get a little frost in the mix. What do you guys like better? Liquid memories versus capacity? Capacity versus gamblers. Thoughts on either. Gamblers with pyramid goes wild. Goes stupid, goes crazy. Um, then memories with our energy deficit also goes wild, super crazy. Capacity is also wild, super crazy. Give me a relic. Goes wild, super. Oh yeah, that's a relic, all right. All right, but now let's talk about the big elephant in the room, and the elephant in the room is the the Necronomicon. Now, Necronomicon is um. Thank you, Shemelvins. I appreciate that. Now. The Necronomicon doesn't do crap, all right? Icaridian or No Reese. No Reese goes crazy. So No Reese is good. No Reese is good. Would you guys take this just for the chance of No Reese? One in three to be amazing. The problem is Necro is bad. And how do we rectify the fact that Necro is bad? 
right? One in three to be bad, one in three to be good, and one in three to be whatever, neutral. Whoo, but you're always lucky. What do you think this is? All right, we've got a dagger as well. So I've got a couple of questions. Do you want to slow play this and go for this big sparkle, or do you want to... Uh, Wow, that, okay, this is pretty good. We got a Nilrees with the Pyramid, and we got a Dagger with the Pyramid, and we also have, okay. All right, let's go this way. Apparitions as well, what the fuck? If I upgrade these bad boys, if we upgrade these bad boys, I right, well, elites are in the business now, boys. Now I just upgrade all my apparitions and we're happy, no? Alright, who wants to sparkle? Or do you want to still slow play and go to this this over here? Do these uh, apparitions give you uh, confidence for the sparkle? You guys want to slow play. Uh, is anybody else a baby back bitch like Phil Frogrix? No, I'm teasing, I'm teasing. Maybe you're maybe being logical, maybe you're being very rational, maybe you are at the risk of ruining your minds, maybe you realize that, um, I don't mean that. I, I keep picking on you, Phil Griggs, and I, I, you know what? We're gonna have to make amends. No way, are you scary? Let me see. Mmm. Not. Nah. No, chill, 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 chill. Hey, man, chill, please. Please, let's not, let's not fight toxicity with toxicity. It's all about love and kindness in this world. What kill? Okay, what kills me? Because we can handle slavers with Grumman Horn. Book of Stabbing is the hardest, no? Oh, I keep forgetting about no reason the first second. That sucks. Got a buffer. Okay, but I, I put a machine learning. I meant to put a, a defrag in the deck. No reason is incredible. No reason is incredible. Dagger's coming up. Dagger's coming on up. Dagger's coming on up, baby. Wow, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. All of a sudden, I'm feeling like the strongest man in the world. Mm, I never left. Just FYI, I never left. Welcome back. Should I kill this thing? Ritual dagger. Capacitor. Creative AI. Flex my muscles. By the way, this ride is staying with me throughout the whole run. We have we have dual cast for this dark orb. Just keep that dark up nice. Look, look, look at this. This pyramid's OP, dude. What the fuck? 
It's not just the pyramid, though. It's also the fact that I have apparitions, and I mean, mainly just because of the apparitions, but. How much damage do we have? 30? 29. It's close. Dacker's going wild. P. We got beam cell now. We got beam cell. Lag again. Oh my god. Kankas hates me. I don't know what I did to deserve this. More apparitions. I feel like if we keep up our apparitions, we're in good sh shape, right? That's my thought. That's my philosophy. I'll wait. I'll wait till we, uh, you guys catch up to this current slide. Let me know when you guys are on current slide. More apparitions. Try getting dagger going. Hologram upgrade. You guys are good? Okay, good. Let's go. Slide over, slide over. Very good, very good. Fission versus rainbow again. Rainbow. Nice. Slick. We're back. Okay, we got deep frag now. We got a seek as well. Looking good. Looking really good. Looking really good. So we can bring back the frosticles. Uh, we're all frosted out of our minds. And we got deep frag. I should have kept the dark oak because dark oak was my, my, my damage. The Dark Horse is my main damage, isn't it? I should bring the Dark Horse back. Oh, Beam Cell is also my damage. Not Beam Cell, but Barrage. Blizzard, let's go. Unironic Blizzard. Alright, I'm trying to kill this thing with a uh, dagger. Are we close? We're getting close, right? We're 
We're getting pretty close. We have intangible for the rest of our life, so we're good. All right, we're getting closer to dagger. And dagger's done. Wow, pyramid's OP. OP. Turbo or multicast? Sheesh. These are great with pyramid. Multicast because the dark orb stuff. Turbo because of energy. Okay, who wants to do multicast? Who wants the turbo? Turbo helps... Because we are currently at an energy deficit. But Multicast is an incredible card because of Rainbow's Dark Orb. Plus, there's thing. Okay, you don't have to triple because I can get Multicast from the thing. P Shard. Someone wanted it. Someone asked for it. Someone said, hey, let's do P Shard. I'm not sure why they wanted it, but we got it. Oh, because now we have Pyramid so we can get all the things like P Shard Pyramid. This is a whole separate different beast, huh? Someone wanted the pyramid, the P-Shard. If I do P-Shard, I need everybody in the chat to be doing this. It gives me, it gives me energy. But I can also just not do that. I can also just take the relic that says sustain on it. Oh, here's the thing. Don't we want to find one bias? If we find bias, we have core charge bias, and that's it. We're done with this class. Like, if we find core charge bias, we're done with the class. We don't need any more defect cards. Nobody's already got us covered. I'll do it for the homies. Who are the homies in this case? I don't know. I got I got okay, I got a dark orb, which is very good. And this is weird because he's doing twenty four and I could block it or I could just like Take a little bit of damage here. Okay. I want to get this dark orb out into play. I want to draw cards. Fission. Fission. All right, gotta get dark orb out. So I, is it apparition dark orb to get that going? Maybe, but what if what if it's just barrage? What if I just kill barrage? What if dark orb was a mistake and it's just barrage stuff? What if we just rerun barrage and just keep doing barrage until we get to our freaking dagger? But we got to free up hand space. If we free up hand space, we're in good shape, right? What if I save barrage? Once I have beam cell. We're drawing dagger soon. There's the dagger. Whoa! I was thinking, I didn't want to say it out loud because I wasn't sure, but I said, you know, a custom court for its Wraith Form, and there's a fucking Wraith Form. Now we are truly ghosts out of our minds. Apparition, apparition, gold, Wraith Form. Whetstone for the. Okay. Okay, another shop. Awkward, awkward. Calipers, RIP. I'm going to miss you. We have a cheeky little cool headed. We even have another hologram. Hologram is probably a pretty good card. Hologram is probably a really good card. 
Damn, that ray form is beautiful. No, I don't have the energy for hologram. Skip. So what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Upgrade the other apparition. Now we have all the apparitions upgraded. Playing silent now, are we? Yes, we are. Make the PMSO plus. Make all the, so now all the apparitions are green. Everything's green. So our ability to stay alive is on point, but our cultist spot is here. So if you're worried about not of killing, well, cultist spot's here. Sunder. Now, Sunder is a card that's pretty good when there's little minions involved, right? Yes or no? I'm going to go ahead and say, yeah. Bullseye as well, though. Upgrade dagger. It's about time we upgrade dagger, huh? Is that what you're thinking? It's about time we upgrade the dagger. I mean, I should have upgraded dagger ages ago, huh? It would have been massive at this point. It would be very hard for us to lose this fight. What, with no reach, cultist spot, and ray form, and three apparitions, it's going to be very hard to lose this fight? If I lose this fight, well, hmm. well, we're not going to lose the fight. Simple as. And then we're going to go into Act 3 with a Pyramid, a P Shard, a ray form, and an extra boss relic, which is going to be sick. This is great. I love this little... Uh... Look at, look at the, the symmetry of this, actually. Like, Whoa. We have three apparitions in a ray form and a perfect little, uh... This is, this is like the definition of my deck right here. This little this cross, cross section on my deck. Uh, what do we want here? Do you guys want any of these cards? What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? You trapped up, were you trapped in there? Were you trapped in there? Why'd you, why'd you bear smell funny? What's, what'd you get into? What'd you get into? Huh? Go, sit behind me. Go. Do I want, do I want Bozo or Doom and Gloom? No. <coughs> Maybe neither? <coughs> Maybe neither, no? Maybe neither. <laughs> what does Bullseye do? <clears throat> Cause I can't just take it no more. This is quite annoying because I don't actually draw cards, so I uh, I kind of need to free a pan space. Amplify ray form. Oh my god! I can't afford it, but if I get turbo, I can. Amplify ray form is stupid good. And now I can do Amplify Reform. Now we can do Amplify Reform. <laughs> do you want it though? I mean, that gives me all the time to, in the world to win, no? If we Amplify Reform, that gives us all the time in the world to win. Uh, GG. And now we have barrages. We have barrages all day with the Sculptus Pot. I love the way the deck is operating. Barrages all day. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. Barrage all day. All freaking day, the barrages.
buy it as well if we wanted to. Buffer if we wanted to. We got all the things. We created up some hand space. We had echo form. I don't need it. I need a free up hand space. I should have held core search for the bias. I need a free up hand space. I might as well pay that person's a free up hand space. That was my bad. I pressure for hand space because I already have the intention, but I just wasted uh, energy there. Uh, we're getting there. We're getting there. Dagger's coming up. We have 11 strength. Nice. And we got a dupe pot. And we got a bias cog. I said all I wanted was a bias cog with the core surge. They gave me a gold bias with the core surge. And then we have Rayform as well. What the f We've already upgraded. Okay, we can probably upgrade Hologram in the future, but whatever. I mean, this is just easy fusion hammer. And now look at this. We have upgraded bias, upgraded Rayform. Every other power we add is going to be already upgraded. And if anything, we should start moving some of these strikes. And boom, the deck's done. The deck is done. we got to get a seek. Get one seek for this biased. Core surge combo, and it's over. It is over. Let's look for Mind Bloom. It is over. It is over. Rebound's hard to get in this situation. No, not rebound, but um, Dagger's hard to get in this situation. Dagger is hard to get in this situation. Hyper Beam. Let's go. That helps. Hyper Beam helps a lot to kill these this, this fight. Hyper Beam helps like incredible amount. We also got a bias though. And bias is pretty fucking good, isn't it? Damn, this deck is just good now all of a sudden, huh? And now we gotta just kill these things and get the dagger on the final guy and it's just that easy, huh? Just that easy, huh? Very good. We have Amplified Rayform if we ever wanted to. to buy all the time in the world. It's kind of broken. It's kind of broken. Don't forget that we also have the... So we have Amplified Rayform now. But we also have the thing that's called... Um, We have Rayform now, but we also have Gremlin Horns as well. Also have Gremlin Horns as well. I want to do this just to get free up hand space because my hand space is ridiculously bad right now. Perfect. Perfect. And now we do Barrage into Dagger. Love that. Flex pot. Turbos. More turbos. Do I need more turbos? Bro, how can the internet be this fucking bad? Makes no sense. How can the internet be this bad? How is Comcast so shit? Are we good? Let me see. Doesn't matter if it's good for the moment. It's not good for the whole big picture. That's the problem. 
Suddenly the internet looks amazing. All right, suddenly uh, the best internet I've ever had in my life. All right, we're good boys. Let's, let's enjoy it. Let's enjoy the moment. We have good internet right now. It's looking like the best it's ever been. All right, so what do we got? Another turbo, it doesn't seem that, that good. The deck has got an incredible... I don't know what you guys have seen or what you guys have missed. Basically, we got a Biascog Plus with a Core Search. If we have Fusion Hammer. We've got a Reform. Deck's really good. I'm going to skip. Flex Pot versus... I'm done. Let's go this way. Let's remember the path. And yes, let's go that way. Okay, beautiful. Let's get out of here. So the problem with this is that I don't really have heal or sustain. So, are there any colors cards that you guys would like? The deck, the deck is nuts, guys. The deck is nuts. And this is going to be a nice, big, beautiful three-win day. Unless I royally screw this up, this should be a three-win day. Which is good, because you guys deserve some wins. Panache versus Purity. The Bomb versus Madness. The Madness was a piece of crap, but whatever. Laser Strike. The Madness was a piece of crap. This is... Part where I break free. All right. Now we just kill this guy with back of uh, course search on. Gorgeous. Purity, absolutely, ship some pain space. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. All right, apparition. And all right, let's, let's wait. I need an actual block card, by the way. There it is. We can do this. Get some of this crap out of my hands. Crippling Cloud. It's cute, but it's useless. I want to seek in my life. Damn. Bye bye, Max HP. I was liking this Max HP, but you know. All right, so what's the next upgrade? Oh, we can't upgrade. We recall. We recall. We fight. Give me rare relics, baby. This dagger is getting big. Would you guys ever do pot the dagger? Or do you want to save deep out for the heart? How greedy are we being right now? Is it even greedy? Okay, it's not even about being greedy. It's about, here's the thing. It's unnecessary use of resources. Because we have infinite intangible in this run. So it's, un it's just unnecessary use of resources. If you know what I mean. Aggregate is pretty good. But so is hyperbeam. This is the part where I break free. And this is going to be a 1v1. It's going to be one v to me, 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 Mr. Old Walker. It's going to be a 1v1. So let's make the 1v1 happen. I did not mean to do turbo in this situation. I didn't mean to do turbo in this situation. Echo form for waveform, GG. Echo from Parade from GG. <laughs> Rayform. They got lethal as well, though. 
This makes it more Shakir. Pair of real shrink pot. Damn. We got ironclad cards all across the board. Body slam on defects, you know, conceptually, it's a cool concept. Having body slam on the uh, the defect. It's a zero cost attack as well. It just brings me joy to have body slam on the defect. However, is it good? No, it does. It doesn't solve anything. It doesn't do shit for me. It just looks cool, but it doesn't actually solve anything. I don't need more damage, and even if I did need more damage, body slam is not really consistent damage. Only works if reinforced body, but that's it. If anything, is true grit, because true grit I can actually start thinning out the deck. True grit is incredible, but it's not upgraded, so. Bye bye. <laughs> Ooh, we got max HP, Reptomancer. Damn. This might be a fight, boys. Alright, buckle up, buckle in. This might actually be a fight. This might actually be something. I have a sneaking suspicion this might be a fight. We got a rave form. We also have a bias in the deck. Let's take a look here. Apparition for this turn. Hold on to the rave form. Let's have a look see. We got Recycle in the mix. What does Recycle do for us? Got a lot of wounds in the mix. I'm not sure if I like that. I want to do a lot of damage. So darkness would be good here because I want to do damage. Darkness would be good here. Give me a sec. Echo form. Echo form wins the game. Echo form wins the game. I play the echo form. I play the apparition. The game is over. It's not even fucking close. Oh my god, echo form is disgusting. Who cares about wounds at that point? There's a dark I was asking for. There's a demon gloom I was asking for. G G brother double brave form double bias double doom and gloom what do you guys want double apparition damn son i want double i want double dagger next turn is what i want that's what i really want double dagger next turn Double Dagger still advances here, right? Did it advance it? Did Double Dagger advance it? Terror makes me... Terror's pretty good. I know we have a lot of damage through uh, orbs. I don't know, because the second co the second attempt is like a copy or something. I don't know. Um, we have a lot of damage through orbs because we have bias cog. But terror seems like... Uh, we also have beam stuff, so maybe terror is kind of a troll. Got the helix as well. I got black, I got white. What you want... Genetic. Maybe Terra was a, a... It was one of those picks where, like, Jeremy was not using his brain kind of thing, you know? That happens sometimes. I could imagine that's one of those picks because... Theme Cell is, like, okay, vulnerable sometimes, but then Terra 
is actually just kind of a bad draw when in reality core surge bias already gives you all the damage you need so yeah terror was pretty bad whatever it's not going to destroy me except for this turn it destroys me a little bit it's not going to destroy me it destroys me a little bit but that's it I only take a little bit of damage But a little bit of damage is a lot when you have this much life. And the deck takes a while to draw through all the cards. Doesn't it, huh? Wait, I need to draw into the dagger. Ah... Uh, uh-oh. Fuck. First time in my life and I'm... How do I do negative damage? How do I, like, take away some of this damage? I can't. The deed is done. The deed is done. I did too much damage. It's okay. That's not going to be the end of me. It would not be the end of me. Alright, we rest. For 9 HP? Yikes. 9 HP. I'm forced to rest again? Oh, no, no, no. Chemical X, who wants it? Now, Chemical X works for Reinforced Body. And that's it. I don't have Multicast. Chemical X is for one Reinforced Body. Does that seem worth it? Or would you rather save your money for the Act 3 shop? Sorry, Act 4 shop. Act for shop seems more apt, no? Unless you guys want to move another strike. Which I do. Another force rest coming up. Beam stop now? Or, uh, let's just... Try to get as much card draw as possible. Kobe Core Surge and Vise, which is right there. Uh, that alone should do a lot to win the fight. We got Core Surge again, because we're going to get another Vise. Or Core Surge for the Ray Form. You know, as a, as a... As a thought. Uh, a lot of my hand... A lot of my cards in my hand just burn a hole in my hand. It's uh, sort of annoying to hold on to Apparition, Apparition, Ray Form, Dagger. Burning a hole in my pocket. I'm not really appreciating that. Deck's going kind of slow. Um, creative eye, does that help me speed up at all? Yeah, I guess. Because it can just make the fight completely free, I suppose. We got the creative AI. We got that permission going. I need a free hand space badly. Creative AI is not going to help me with hand space, actually. It's just going to stall me. How about we focus on doing damage? Because. Yeah, this is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Dagger's still bringing a hole in my pocket. Got the reforms. Let's get this out of the way. All right, now let's go crazy. It's getting close. Dagger's getting close. Okay, that fight was way too slow, but 
We got a buffer plus. We have so many defensive options, but I'm worried about my offensive options. I have defensive options for days, but I'm worried about... I mean, once I have buys... Okay, fuck. Buffer plus is pretty good. You have way too many defensive options. You know what I really need is... I need to get a seek for this bias. Get it out ASAP. That's what I really need. Well, for the time, for the moment, we had, oh, we had double core surge. Check that out. Double core surge, double biased. Look at that, boys. Echo Farm makes this deck broken. All right. That's quite nice. When you have Echo Farm, the deck is broken. Oh, my God. Dagger. Nope. Halt. Catalyst. Nope. All right, we forced rest. And let's go. Is Rick want a scary girl, scary boy, scary whatever? Um, a little bit with this turn one hand, I would say so, yes. Let's kill this thing. But terror, cool. I don't want to use buffer like that, but I think operation could be used better, so let's just waste the buffer then, I guess. <laughs> let's just use the buffer then. Ma uh, wait, this is because I clicked Magnus. Okay, if I didn't click Madness this run, this Madness would have been any other card and would have been fine. But unfortunately, I clicked Madness this run. And I, get, I pay the price. Purity of these cards and apparition now. Purity of these cards and apparition now. Or I could just block block and take some damage to the face. Capacitor. Capacitor seems pretty good. Once I get through this uh once I get through this these turns. Capacitor seems pretty good. We could even save Apparition here. If we wanted to, we could save Apparition. And I say, why not? Why not save Apparition, huh? Add a multicast to the mix. Nah, no need. No need. I did prismatic for you guys, but the internet said, fuck you. All right, this guy's dead. Let's go focus on this guy now. Purify some of this crap. I need to draw cards. I do need to draw some cards. This is a good time to do one apparition, I guess. I need to draw cards, cards, cards. Keeping the light, keeping the frost is okay. I guess we actually can just not use apparition at all. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I guess our deck is just really that good. I'm waiting for bias. Bias at the bottom of my deck. Once I draw bias, we are good. I'm not playing buffer this fight. All right, bye bye buffer, and hello bias cock. GG. All right, and now our bias is out, our capacitor is out, and we can start scaling. 
with the big, beautiful uh, Milrys. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. At uh, some point, I'm gonna have to get rid of this um, dark orb and get more frost. No, for the next for the next act, for the next phase we have Raven for the next phase. So what if I just slow play this, kill this guy off attacks, right? And then make a big dark up for the next phase and just boom, be done with it. Multicast dark up for the next phase, GG. How does that sound? I kind of wish I took multicast now. Now I think about it, multicast, save dark orb, boom, next phase, one shot. Saves me time, saves me life. But now in a situation where like, hmm. Like I'm kind of wanting to do dark orb now, but if I do dark orb now, the next phase is even harder. Ah, I kind of made a mistake there. Kind of made a mistake there by not taking the multicast. Or a recursion or something. I guess Glacier helps to not take damage in the next phase. Because we also have a Rayform in the mix. I... I could just kill now. Fine. Probably fine in the next phase. If I, just go, if I just go full Lightning, we're probably fine. I mean, full, full Frost, I mean. There's Rayform's also in the mix. Okay, free to pan space. I got sharply buffers really nilly. And it's nothing but a formality this fight. Get the barrage in the mix. Hell yeah, barrage. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And Rayform is still burning a hole in my pocket. How about time we spend that Rayform? Get it out of the way. Now we go big dick damage. Or attempt to at least. How much is Blizzard by the way? Might have been a lot. Now we got a big Dark Orb. I already daggered this fight. GG. Very nice. No race versus Vicky win classic. And now the fight that scales. Awaken one's a little uh passive. This fight not so much. Hey, little rascal. Not so much. Okay. So how are we gonna tackle this? Well, let's take a look. Let's take a look here. Is today Friday? It is. I have a Spanish lesson today, don't I? But it's in an hour, we have an hour. Okay, let's lock in, boys. For this fight, I wanna do big damage with the dagger on the guy on the right. On the donut. I'm gonna use Rayform. Not now, though. We don't raid for him now, right? We never raid for him now. Is it, do I ever do beam cell so I can get rid of this guy's statuses? Is it ever beam cell to get rid of his statuses? So, rebound beam cell, get rid of statuses. Do it one more time after, then terror goes off. Yes.
more barrages? More aggregate. Or is it ever... All for one. All for one brings like beam cell. Eh. Barrage does damage, but not that much. And then aggregate gives me energy, which seems okay. I, wonder, I should have kept the second rebound for even beam cell, but I wanted to get rid of my hands. Got beam cell, how gonna beam cell terror finally. So now this guy is vulnerable. Sounds fine. Sounds fine to me. Sounds fine to me. So we're gonna say bias once we have core search, obviously. Now we have a vulnerable donut, which is not bad when I have dagger in the deck. We got the core search with the bias. Very freaking good, especially when I got an apparition in the mix. If I really want to keep up the damage, I could even do a rainbow straight up. I guess the dark will go on immediately. That's important. Dark will go on immediately is important. Because of things like bullseye. Question, do we want to scale dagger for this fight? Yes or no? So I was thinking yes. Is it time to be ready from now? Um, or double apparition now? Free up, hand, free up more hand space like that. Double apparition frees up more hand space. I think hand space seems important. I don't want to draw into the shit ever again. Do I, do I ever want to draw Glacier again? No. But I don't want to draw any of the defense ever again either. I want to get rid of some shit. I mean, drawing back to the Glacier isn't bad for the future. Because in the future, this guy is only going to have like 8 attack, right? And 8 attack isn't that big a deal. Keep Glacier around. All right, we're gonna do barrage, beam cell. Sorry, barrage, bullseye, dual cast. Fuck, it's taking so long to do the thing. The purity on these defense would have been sick. I'm trying to do barrage, bullseye. Hmm. Am I gonna run out of time if I do this reform stuff? Nah, cause at that point I had frost to outscale, right? Plus no reese. So we're fine. Like by the time this guy's dead, which is gonna be happening very soon, then I have no reason to outscale Donut Okay. Okay. But I will say it's freaking taking forever to draw to the cards that I want to draw into. That's a big waste of dagger damage, isn't it? Who cares? Okay, so nine strength, but I got scaling with no reese. Now defends are completely curses. Complete curse. Okay. We have two, we have two buffers. No problem. Big dark group coming through. Lots of daisies coming through. Who 
with that next turn. No, I'm trying to get the thing for Bullseye, which is right there. Honestly, I might have to do putt. Um, because I just wasted my um. I just wasted my operation where I didn't need to. So I might do. Bullseye now. Man, it would have been so sick to get the dual cast going on the bullseye now. Perfect. Perfect. Hologram on the dual cast. G G. Let's go. Bring this bad boy home. We got a we got a dupe pot for the heart and 191 gold. These forced rests are brutal though. We got Dolly's mirror. We have a loop plus. Dolly's mirror on what? Bias card? Dolly's mirror on Rayform. Wait, Dolly's mirror Rayform is GG, right? Imagine not having one but two Rayform pluses on the defect. So, okay. The double bias means we have all the focus in the world, right? And why is that good? Well, with two bias, I could do do putt core search and then play both bias. Right? And if you have two buys, it's sort of like ray form, except you're also getting a lot of damage off of that as well. My damage is a problem. This you're noticing that my damage is a problem, right? Loop helps us not get died to frost. So loop is like. We could do double ray form, but then I don't know if I don't know if I do enough damage in time. Double ray form, because my damage is really bad. I like what I just said. Let's go. I kinda want the loop as well, but okay, let's go. Two pot core surge for biased. That's the goal. Uh, I'm curious. Are we gonna be fine? Because we don't have We got Seek, we got Seek, we got Seek, we got Seek. Next turn is scary though. We have the... Dream first body. And a dream. Got the buffer, which is useful. Small flesh wound, no problem. Got ray form, let's go. Big ray form, big ray form. Got the bias, got the bias, got the bias. Let's go. All right. Let's kill this guy. And then 1v1, this power shield, no problem. All right, I already, I already ruined my core search, right? But that's fine. Dagger's big enough for, like, I'm thinking. 
Dagger's big enough. The dagger gets gets big for this fight and this fight only. That's the whole point for dagger to get to this fight, and dagger got to this fight, so we are fine. I need more damage though. I could bring that person so I never die. How about that? How's that sound? Cool. And now it's 1v1. Really? <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Can you kill the guy in the goddamn left? On the right, I mean? The hell is going on, dude? Portrait for another bias, which is nice. How's the guy on the right not dead? So confused. I'm live again, stream? Really, stream elements? I've been live for six hours. You told me I've been live four times, five times already. This is a nightmare, guys. Stream elements taunting me, telling me I'm going, I'm finally live. Greeting me. It's not a greeting. Okay, so, um. Yeah, okay. It is what it is, man. All right, all right, all right, all right. Um. Damn, this, guy, this 1 HP warrior. Absolute beast. Boom! Give me the biased, you sick son of a gun. Give me the dark orb. And get me the fuck out of here. Alright boys, we're going to the heart. We have Dupont Court Search. For double bias, will it go the distance? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. I got buffered for days. And where that comes from is even more buffers. Get out of here. Scoundrel. Alright, that's a screw for the comic book. I never bought it's deadly poison for something I never needed. Alright, boys. Let's see. How lucky are our draws? Well, this draw for, so far is really bad because a couple of we don't get here's what we need. If I don't draw apparitions, please make a big attack first. Alright? That's all I ask. If there's no apparitions, please do big attack first so I can do my little ray form. Sorry, my little um, helix. And once I get my Dupont Core Search, I just gotta draw bias, bias, and then we have ray form three apparitions in the deck. Double bias should help with the damage off the back of dark orbs, lightning orbs, and yeah, I'll just go full face every time. I'm still worried about my damage, but I'm hoping, hoping ten focus helps me get damage. Usually, ten focus should help. And okay, so how do we play turn one? Well, hand space is king, right? We realize we need hand space. So, if a man needs hand space, I think you give the man hand space, right? Now, was there a merit in keeping rebound around? What do you guys think? Rebound can do some things. Oh, we got the double core surge. It's happening. It's happening. Now we just need to stay alive and not die to the multi attack. Now, what are the over under that we die to the multi attack? Well, if I do double core surge now, the multi attack can kill me pretty easily. So I'm not going to double core surge yet until I know for a fact I don't die next turn. 
seems fair, right? Plus, getting Rebo out now helps him scale up the Dark Orb. The Dark Orb is relevant because our damage is really bad. Not sure what Rebo can do for us. Not sure what, what does Hologram do. Hologram gives us back... Um... What does Hologram do in this deck? Hologram's a piece of crap. Okay. Nice. Let's go, amigo. Let's a fucking go. Let's a fucking go. Amplify. Amplify for the reform. <laughs> GG Biased Biased Capacitor Multicast Now multicast is going to help us do lethal right Because it is big ass dark orbs But glacier is more frost But we already have frost we're good Multicast Alright now push damage Now to push damage now it's time to push damage. Barrage is also pushing damage. They can amplify buffer as well. If I bring back cold snap, I can save some life. I wonder if Wi-Fi is actually better. Unironically. Another core surge. Do we have another bias in the deck? What about creative AI scaling? Creative AI scaling with Amplify, or do you want to do core surge for the 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 inevitable Rayform? Rayform is just broken anyways, though. But once we pick Rayform, we're going for the lethal, no? Why don't you think Rayform is going? What the hell? How am I getting 11,000 keep? What is going on with the internet, brother? Oh, yeah, there's nothing, nothing I can do but laugh to hide the pain. Okay, we gotta start doing damage though. Like, no joke. Damage, damage, damage. It's hard to do damage here, man. It's hard to do damage. I need to get terror applied. That's gonna help our damage a lot. We're taking beat of death damage like crazy. Is it amplified ray form? And we Echo form, okay. Echo form amplified ray form. Huge. Echo form is here. We got multicast. Uh, multicast does the damage cap for this turn.
Okay. Now we need to get rid of the artifacts and do more damage because we're not doing enough damage. Double apparition if we wanted it. Double ball landing for more damage. Okay, we're pushing damage, we're pushing damage. We got double buffer, we have 6 HP in a dream. Double apparitions. Double buffers. This is for beat of death insurance. And GG. Double barrage. Amplify buffer. Get it out of the way. Now we can never lose the beat of death because we have four fucking buffers. Double Warp and Tear for damage. GG. There it is, boys. Three wins. Three classes. 100% win rate today. And 100% win rate for the internet being a piece of shit. But I tried. My energy was there. My intentions were there. My love was there. And my brain was there. Can't say the same for everything else, but you know what? Some of you were here. <laughs> <laughs>